About three decades ago, engineers from the Ingolstadt-based carmaker realized that ultimate performance doesn't necessarily have to come with a coupe or even sedan body style. They realized that performance cars could come in more practical packages too. So, the legend was created, the iconic RS2, which was later succeeded by several iconic wagons, including the most recent RS6. And as the company is shifting to a battery electric layout, the latest iteration of this model seems like a perfect swan song, a limited edition with even more performance in mind than the standard RS6. Meet the 2024 Audi RS6 GT, the perfect family performance car. As mentioned, Audi is shifting to electric cars, just like most other automakers. The company already pledged to end releasing new models with internal combustion engines by 2026, and with not much time left, this is a perfect moment to pay tribute to everything Audi engineers have done to make wagons exciting to drive. To remind you, many rival companies tried to offer ultimate performance in a wagon package, but none of them was ever able to offer such a perfect blend of performance and practicality. So, it isn't a surprise that Audi has been left alone in this segment. Key competitors like the Mercedes-AMG E63 S-Wagon and Porsche Panamera Sport Turismo have been discontinued, so Audi's engineers got all the freedom to create a vehicle that's going to be remembered as one of the most exclusive high-performance wagons of all time, with only 660 units produced and sold worldwide. So, the first step of making this wagon exclusive, something that will eventually become a highly desirable collector's item, was to offer a unique styling. And Audi's designers really did their best. They decided to go with a retro approach with the aesthetics that pay homage to the company's vintage days of motorsports. It's easy to find a lot of similarities from the more recent RS6 GTO concept from 2020, but the real inspiration was obviously the Audi Quattro IMSA GTO, a legendary race car that dates back to 1989. Of course, the first thing you'll notice are those super cool old-school decals that celebrate Audi's participation in motorsports back in the day. Equally prominent is the new front bumper design, which utilizes new, reshaped air intakes that create a perfect synergy together with those bulging fenders with integrated vertical air vents. For those who prefer a cleaner layout, the RS6 GT can also be ordered without these retro decals. If that's the case, then buyers have a choice between five color options – Arcona White, Nardo Gray, Kronos Gray Metallic, Madeira Brown Metallic, and Mythos Black Metallic. From the side, the 1980s scream through those white wheels, even though the actual design is practically the same as in the slightly less exclusive RS6 performance with that Y-spoke layout. Apparently, the color makes a significant difference in this case. Then, we finally come to the rear end of the car and, once again, there's a revised bumper and, just like the one at the front, its shape seems bulkier, making the whole wagon look even wider. Of course, it's hard not to notice the new spoiler, borrowed directly from the RS6 GTO concept. Even with all these visual enhancements, this is unmistakably an Audi wagon. The overall layout is the same as in the standard RS6, with the design based on the good old MLB platform. But the GT is way more than just visual enhancements. This version brings a comprehensive upgrade in pretty much every aspect, starting from the upgraded chassis, brakes, weight reduction, retuned transmission and differential, and many more. The company wanted to offer something that's actually much more than just an appearance package. They wanted to improve the overall performance, even though the standard RS6 is already an impressive performer. So, one of the first modifications that was made was the installment of a new coilover suspension. This manually adjustable, race-focused setup includes stiffer springs, three-stage dampers, and a lower center of gravity, along with 30% stiffer front and 80% rear anti-roll bars. Then, there's the iconic Quattro all-wheel drive system with a modified differential tuned for more rear-biased power distribution. All in all, stiffer suspension, lower ground clearance, and upgraded differential seem like a proven recipe complemented by new Continental Sport Contact 7 tires 
which are claimed to ensure even better grip, resulting in, among other improvements, shorter braking distance by 6 to 7 feet. Then it was time for weight savings, so all those carbon fiber parts aren't just there for the sake of aesthetics. Carbon fiber bonnet, front wheel arches, air vents, mirror caps, rear diffuser, all these parts contribute to a total weight saving of around 110 pounds, according to Audi officials, which should make this wagon even more agile than the standard RS6. The GT treatment continues on the inside, with a few more carbon fiber parts that contribute to overall weight reduction. The most prominent are the seats, with carbon fiber backs and a combination of leather and microfiber upholstery, on which you can notice red honeycomb stitching, copper-colored highlights, and GT lettering. Then, you'll also notice plenty of red and copper accents all around the cabin, on the steering wheel, armrest, center console, floor mats, etc. But despite all these exclusive aesthetical details, the overall layout remains familiar. This is still a classic RS6 with a sophisticated dashboard design that combines conservative and modern solutions in such a nice fashion. Cutting-edge tech features are there too, starting from the well-known virtual cockpit. In a typical Audi fashion, there's a combination of two touchscreens on the center stack, with the upper measuring 10.1 inches and the lower being 8.6 inches diagonally. Of course, connectivity features like Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and a Wi-Fi hotspot are all part of the standard equipment, just like the premium Bang & Olufsen audio system and built-in navigation. Also, there's pretty generous offer of convenience features, even though this is a performance-oriented car. Things like heated and ventilated front seats and four-zone climate control are standard, while there are also upgrades like massaging front seats, heated rear seats, etc. Safety features like forward collision warning, automatic emergency braking, adaptive cruise control, and lane keep assist are also standard, along with night vision with large animal and pedestrian detection. But despite all the convenience, luxury, and performance, the RS6 GT remains true to its nature, offering a super practical interior with plenty of passenger room at both rows and a solid 30 cubic feet of cargo room behind the rear seats. Finally, we've come to what's under the hood, and you may be surprised or not, things remain rather familiar in this aspect. Audi decided to keep the same figures as in the RS6 performance, which was upgraded last year. Of course, we're talking about now the most powerful variant of the 4-liter V8 ever. The good old twin-turbo V8 now puts out around 621 horsepower and 627 pound-feet of torque and gets slight power assistance from a mild 48-volt hybrid system. Just like the standard RS6, this one also comes coupled with an 8-speed automatic gearbox, though the transmission has been revised with optimized shift tuning. Of course, the famous Quattro all-wheel drive system is part of the standard equipment, just like the retuned differential with more rear-biased power delivery, as mentioned. With all that power in mind, excellent performance is guaranteed. Thanks to weight reduction as well as upgraded transmission and differential, the Ingolstadt carmaker actually claims a little bit quicker acceleration compared to the equally powered RS6 performance. This means that the 0-60 could easily end up under 3 seconds, considering that the standard RS6 can hit 60 in just 3.1 seconds. That would definitely mean a step up into the supercar territory. As for other figures, the top speed is 190 miles per hour, while the estimated fuel economy goes around 15 mpg city and 22 mpg highway, if anyone cares. The 2024 Audi RS6 GT is expected to hit markets pretty soon, and from what we know, it'll be very exclusive. As mentioned, the company decided to make just 660 of these. Of course, most of them will be offered in Europe and North America, but officials confirm that about 20 examples will be delivered to Australia as well. As for the price, the exact figures are yet to be announced, but some sources suggest that the US market version will cost around $170,000. For those looking for something equally exciting but a little bit cheaper, Audi continues to offer the RS6 Performance. That version starts at around $127,000 in North America 
and for that money, you may not get exclusive visual details and all those carbon fiber parts, but you still get the same engine power and sporty suspension. It's definitely an excellent, more affordable alternative. What do you think of the 2024 Audi RS6 GT? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.